What are all these humans doing here? I don't care if they want breakfast. There are too many of them. They've invaded my space. I can't breathe with all of them in here. Why are you laughing? I know a restaurant needs customers, but this, all this is ridiculous. The line goes around the corner. They're just standing there, staring. It's freaking me out. Why are they here? I get that. But why so many of them? All at once? Holiday season? What are you talking about? Shopping? I don't shop. I conjure what I need. Well, then it sucks to be a human. What I think is fun and what you think is fun isn't always the same thing. <laughs> yeah, we do agree on that. Hey, I have an idea. Let's transport to the cave and have some of that fun. What about the humans? Let them make their own breakfast. They shouldn't invade my restaurant en masse. I can deal with a handful at a time, but this? All this? Hell no. I am out of here. What? Cobalt? And the healer? You called them, didn't you? No, we don't need help. We just need to leave. This was a bad idea. Why did I ever think this would work? Hey, Dragon, congrats. Uh, this restaurant is happening. Let's get the show on the road. I may be part wolf now, but I don't do well at high noon. You're shocked, I'm sure. What do we need to do? Lead the way, Dragon. I'll help in the kitchen, and Blondie can help Oakley take orders and bring out the food. I don't take orders, Wolfman. You should know that by now. You take my orders when you want to. <laughs> Would you rather get down and dirty in the kitchen? I'll get down and dirty with you anywhere. But somehow I don't think we're talking about the same thing. Later, baby. A little bit later. Promises, promises. Okay, Oakley, show me what to do. That table over there? How do you know which order goes where? Numbered, huh? That's smart. Here you are. Pancakes, pancakes, and more pancakes. Enjoy. Hey, don't tell me what to do, lady. Excuse me? I've had a shit morning, and I don't need the wait staff telling me what to do. Blondie, you can't turn him into a newt, no matter how 
much he deserves it. These are humans. Pfft. I won't hurt him. Not here, anyway. Oh, shit. Consider it a suggestion, such as enjoy it, or don't. Choke on it, or don't. The choice is yours. It's great to have options, don't you agree? <laughs> She's a feisty one. I like her. Yeah, now that that disaster is probably averted, let me say congrats. Congrats? For what? What's happening now? Yeah, your restaurant is booming. It's standing room only. For a new business, that's almost unheard of. Pfft. I've got such a hungry horde of humans surrounding my building that I had to disturb my friends and ask for their help. You're so gloom and doom, dragon. Lighten up. It's the holiday season. It's impossible to predict the size of the crowds. Holiday season? I never realized that was even a thing until Oakley showed up on my mountain. Yeah, humans celebrate all kinds of things. Deviled egg day, cliche day, uh, pink underwear day. Don't try to make sense of it, just, just roll with it. If they want to be happy about something, why rain on their parade? Parade? Aren't parades outside? I haven't heard anything about a parade. No parades in my restaurant. Oakley! Relax, dragon. I didn't mean it that way. There aren't going to be any floats chugging between the tables. How did I even get here? I used to have a simple life. Uh, I hear you, brother. Mates bring spice to life, don't they? Spice? Is that a code for stress, chaos, and mayhem? All that and more. Yeah, it's great, huh? I forgot. You live with a demon, too. I would have lost my mind long ago. Spark is gone more than not, now that the blood-sucking prince has been making his moves. You live dangerously saying words like that, considering your mate is a vampire. Yeah, Blondie knows I don't mean anything by it. She scares me. <laughs> That's half the fun. Pick that up. Uh, she means well. Yeah, well, that human she just scared the shit out of might disagree. It uh, seems like manners are in short supply this morning. My mountain is calling me. I know dragons are solitary folks, and being around people isn't always easy. Yeah, that's an understatement. But it's got to make you feel good to hear all these people rave about your pancakes. Mm. I know you have great hearing. You can hear what they're saying. I hear stomachs rumbling. And? Did anyone ever tell you you're pushy? Yeah, I wear it proudly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've heard a few people say they taste good. I think the healer needs to take a look at your ears. You're not hearing what I'm hearing. 
No, I don't need her to get any closer to me than she already is. Well, if you can't hear all the compliments, it might be needed. I hear them. You just don't listen to them. You only listen to the bad stuff. <sighs> the line seems to have died down. I think you guys can get on with your day. It was great of you to come by and help. Uh-uh. Shooing me out won't change the truth of what I'm telling you. I'm not shooing you out. I'm being respectful of your time. And you want me to shut up and go away. I'll gladly go away. I'd love to be on my mountain right now. <laughs> yeah, these people can go anywhere to eat. They're choosing to be here. They want your food in your restaurant. Why do you do crap like this? <laughs> You would never shirk your responsibilities. Well, I sure want to, though. I hear you, brother. I hear you. It looks like you've got this. We'll get out of your hair. Thanks, you guys. Blondie? Yeah, let's head out. But I'm having such fun. I have a different kind of fun in mind. Ooh, lead the way. Is everything okay out there? Do you think she left any spells behind? Yeah, I'd believe just about anything when it comes to her. You have an idea. Well, considering who you just spent time with, that scares the hell out of me. All right, just tell me. You want me to turn over my kitchen to another cook? Do you think I'm doing a bad job? Supervise? Me? Supervise another cook? Another restaurant? Baby, we had to ask for help with this place. How could we possibly run more? I don't know what I'm going to do with this place. Thinking about opening another restaurant is making my head spin. Can we talk about this later? Oh, baby, come on. Please, let's hold off on making any rash decisions. We'll go back to our mountain and snuggle down in the hot springs and talk this out. I'll listen, baby. I promise 